Doctors and patients say it's still too hard to prescribe medical marijuana, even though it was legalised in Australia five months ago. Today, experts met here in Adelaide to discuss its health benefits and why it's struggling to lose the stigma. 73-year-old basketball legend Ken Cole suffers from incurable bone cancer and credits medicinal cannabis with keeping him alive. It's the only reason I can eat. It's relieved the pain. It takes away the nausea in minutes. Dr David Caldicott says hundreds of Australians are in the same boat. But despite new federal laws, it's not easy to get your hands on. There is a problem where patients can access an illicit product far easier than a medicinal one. They require a certain amount of paperwork. For me as a GP, I don't have time to be doing that. Speaking at a conference in Adelaide, Dr Caldicott says we're lagging behind the rest of the world. But Ben Fitzsimons hopes to change that with a commercial cannabis plant, possibly at the Holden site. We're sitting there in the, on the sidelines, I guess you'd say, for the moment, but we've got another facility already uh, earmarked. Simplifying the federal legislation's likely to take time, but Dr Caldicott says the state government could introduce an amnesty to make it easier to access medicinal cannabis for those most in need. People, for example, who are in pain and uh, have a terminal illness. There are certainly people who cannot afford to wait. The state government says it's already cut some of the red tape. Andrea Nicholas, 7 News.